Hi, it's Palette PC, and it's May 2015, and I am going to be doing the stitching style tag that Pam Reed started. There will be a link to her video below where you can find all of the questions. Question number one, favorite fabric. My favorite fabric is Ada. I like 18 count the most, 16 count if I'm doing something that is full coverage and 14 count if I want it to be a larger project. Question two, hoop or frame? Actually, the answer is both. I love my um, German non-slip hoops. I also love my Millennium frame and my Q-snaps. Question number three, do you use a stand or just hold your frame? I um, stitch in hand. I stitch at a computer desk and there is no room for a stand to be set up anywhere in the area. Question number four. What is your favorite time to stitch? I'm a night owl so I stitch all through the night and early into the morning mostly. Question number five. Do you use a printed paper copy or your chart or digital? I use both. I use paper charts for smaller projects, for larger, more detailed projects like Chatelaine's and Heaven and Earth Designs, I use digital copies. I use the Foxit Reader PDF program for the digital copies, and I use a scanner and then blow up the paper copies so that I can see the symbols clearly. Question number six, are you a floss licker? Occasionally I do use floss licking, but primarily I use the low rain needle threader that I showed in my um, five favorite tools video. Question number seven, do you hoard or buy supplies as needed? I hoard, I love to collect all types of materials, tools, uh, beads, everything for all of my hobbies. I buy lots of it and keep it on hand so that I can um, start any project at any time. Question number eight, what is your favorite floss? I think right now my favorite is probably Karen Collections. I like water lilies, wildflowers. I love the way that they stitch up, the fact that they do not um, shred or twist as much or have not and the way the colors come out in the hand dyes. My second favorite of course is DNC. That's what I use for pretty much everything else. Question number nine. Are you a serial starter or do you have a whip at a time? I am definitely a serial starter. I love starting a new project. Question number ten. Do you have more FFOs or UFOs? I would have to say I have more fully finished objects. I, um, I've only been stitching a year, but the year that I started, I, I finished 26 projects. Question number 11. Do you watch TV while stitching? I don't actually watch TV, but I will watch YouTube videos or podcasts or different series of TV shows on DVD while I'm stitching. I do prefer to listen to audible audiobooks though when I'm stitching. Question number 12. Do you mostly stitch alone or do you ever get together with someone to stitch? I stitch alone. Question 13. Do you like to experiment and alter things with your charts or do you stitch stitch them just as written? I experiment and alter charts quite a bit. Question 14. Do you bobbinate floss or not? No, I do not use bobbins. I don't like all the extra crimps it puts into the thread. Question 15. Do you start a project in the middle of your fabric or at the corner? It depends on the project. If it's a project where I want to have a central portion of it completely done as I stitch, if it's in the center, that's where I start. 
full coverage projects like heaven and earth designs, I start in the upper corner. Question 16, do you have a whip rotation? No, I don't do any type of rotation. I don't put any type of scheduling or rules on any of my hobbies. Question number 17, do you use a timekeeper to keep track of how long it takes you to complete a project? No, again, I, it's a hobby. I don't need to know how long anything takes. It takes as long as it takes. Question 18, do you use the parking technique? Uh, yes, I use it on some different types of projects. I use it on the more complicated ones that have a lot of color changes. Um, sometimes I'll use it on a, on a small project as well, just for convenience. But yes, I do park, especially on large projects. Number 19, do you keep your ort? No, it's garbage. It goes in the garbage. Uh, question 20, do you like to have a snack or drink while stitching? Yes, I always have water, no matter where I'm stitching or what, I, what I'm stitching on, I always have water nearby. So those are all 20 of the questions. Again, the link to Pam's original video where you can read all the questions are there. And I tag all Floss Tube Stitchers to, um, Record answers to this tag as well.